K9 training. Arrow's training never ends. Several times a month, Arrow and Officer Mike train with other officers and their K9 partners. One exercise the police dogs do is to run through an obstacle course. The dogs practice getting over, under, around and through difficult spots. Arrow had to learn how to walk up and down every steep open stairs. He also had to learn to walk over a large open grating, the kind you often see on city streets. At first he spread his paws to help keep his balance. His legs began to quiver and he whined a frightening cry. He had to practice over and over. Officer Mike kept saying, good boy, you can do it. Arrow was brave and trusted his partner, but he still does not like open gratings or steep stairs. Arrow's sense of smell. Canines have very powerful noses, hundreds of times more powerful than human noses. That's why one of Arrow's most helpful talents on the police force is his ability to find things by smell. When children play hide and seek, they may think they are well hidden. Their dog can find them right away. The same is true when a child is lost or wanders away from home. Arrow can find the child by using his sense of smell. Each person has a scent that is different from everyone else's scent. Even twins do not smell the same. A person's unique smell comes from the food he or she eats, the soap and shampoo he or she uses, the clothes he or she wears, and the place he or she lives. What is one of Eros' most helpful talents? One of Arrow's most helpful talents on the police force is his ability to find things by smell. At the vets. Arrow goes to Dr. Morse, a veterinarian, for regular checkups. Arrow must lie still on a table while the doctor examines him. Once Arrow had a small infection on his neck, Dr. Morse gave him some medicine so he would get better. Because a police dog works so hard and has such an important job, he needs to be healthy. At the end of the checkup, Dr. Morse lifts Arrow to the floor, pets him and says, good dog. Where does Arrow go for regular checkups? Arrow goes to Dr. Morse, a veterinarian for regular checkups. Nurses and teachers often write to the chief of police to ask if Arrow can visit children in the hospital or school. Arrow likes children and is always gentle with them. He is even gentler when visiting a sick child. He lies down staying very still and quiet so the children won't be afraid of him. When Officer Mike and Arrow visit schools, Arrow rests on the floor beside Officer Mike. Together they demonstrate the different commands Arrow will obey. The children ask many questions. Why is there a police badge on Arrow's collar? How high can Arrow jump? How fast can Arrow run? Officer Mike carefully answers the questions. Arrow's badge shows everyone that he is a working police dog. He can jump over an eight foot wall when he is chasing a criminal. He can run very fast, about 40 miles an hour. Even the fastest person can only run about 24 miles an hour.
How high can Arrow jump? He can jump over an eight-foot wall when he is chasing a criminal. Petting Arrow Children often want to pet Arrow. Officer Mike tells them the rules. Never try to pet a strange dog until you ask permission from the owner. Never come up behind Arrow. He might get frightened and snap at you. Never ever hug a canine around the neck. Walk up to a police dog slowly from the front so he can see you. Let him sniff your hand. Pet his head and ears gently. Talk to him softly. Back at the station. At the end of a 12-hour work shift, there is always a final job to be done at the police station. After talking with his friends on the force, Officer Mike sits down and writes a report for the police chief about the whole day or night. Arrow lies down by Officer Mike's chair. Now, what does Officer Mike do after talking with his friends on the force? Officer Mike sits down and writes a report for the police chief about the whole day or night. Fellow officers. After the report is written, Officer Mike and Arrow will go home together. When Officer Mike goes to bed, Arrow will plop down on the floor near the bed. He lays his head on his paws and with a sigh goes to sleep near his best friend. Neither of them knows what surprises tomorrow's patrol will bring, but they are well prepared. They both love being police officers. What do Officer Mike and Arrow both love? They both love being police officers.